Today is Saturday of the first week in Advent. Like earlier this week, we celebrate another saint, this time Saint Francis Xavier. He was among the first Jesuits, a religious order founded in the 1500s by Saint Ignatius of Loyola. Saint Francis Xavier was a teacher of philosophy in Paris. He had a promising career that opened him to honors and prestige really a comfortable life. When he was 24, his good friend St. Ignatius planted a seed of faith in his life that eventually led him to discerning a call to be one of the founding members of the Jesuit order and to the priesthood. From there, he was ordained and went on to be a missionary in the East Indies, India, and Japan. He desired to go to China, but before reaching the mainland, he died. He won countless souls to Christ. Today's gospel tells of Jesus' heart being moved with pity for the crowds because they were a sheep without a shepherd. The harvest, he said, is abundant, but the laborers are few. So ask the master of the harvest to send out laborers for the harvest. This gospel is traditionally read with the priesthood in mind, and I do so today. The example of St. Ignatius and St. Francis is one of the harvest being great and laborers being few for the harvest. I invite you to pray for vocations to the priesthood, especially in the Archdiocese of Dubuque, every day during Advent. We need more laborers for the harvest. St. Ignatius invited St. Francis Xavier to consider the priesthood. You can do the same by inviting male youth and young men to consider the priesthood. Their gifts, talents, piety, and service will be ways that God will raise awareness in you to make the invitation. The harvest is ready and laborers are few. Pray, ask for, and invite priestly vocations. It's been great being with you this week. Tomorrow, another staff member will assume the charge of reflecting with you throughout the second week of Advent. God's blessings be upon you.